And now the night everyone in the football world has been longing for. Millions will be watching around the world. It is, of course, the biggest final in club football, the UEFA Champions League final. Welcome to the commentary box. Derek Ray here, joined by Stuart Robson. It is Chelsea up against Manchester United. Well, what a night, Derek. Two great teams, a perfect pitch, a magnificent stadium, and millions watching around the world. What more could you ask for, apart from maybe different commentators? And here's how it looks for Chelsea. Kepa is the goalkeeper. Thiago Silva plays alongside Kalidou Koulibaly in central defence. Raheem Sterling plays with Mason Mount on the flanks. And the idea is to have just the one striker up there trying to pose problems for the opposition. Manchester United. David De Gea starts in goal. Anthony plays with Jadon Sancho on the flanks. And the centrepiece of the attack is Marcus Rashford. And they're underway now in the Champions League final. We're about to find out which team is the best in Europe. How can he take them on and beat them? Marcus Rashford in position. Well, it still could be dangerous. Surely! Oh, a fantastic save! But the offside flag has gone up and it grinds to a halt. Pili Quetta. Now with Jorginho. Sterling. Chilwell. And thwarted there following the cross. And it took a touch on the way through. So a corner here. Played over. It hasn't come to very much. In by Sterling. Not messing around with that clearance. Mount. Firing it towards goal. Able to clear the danger. Corner kick though here. Over it comes, and taken cleanly by the goalkeeper. And then his younger days, they used to call Mateo Kovacic the little genius. He's not so little anymore, quite experienced now. Stuart, what do you expect to see from him today? Well, the best players are the ones that can play in tight areas, and he can certainly play in tight areas. He wriggles out of situations, he can find that penetrative pass and he's such a good player when he gets the ball out of his feet and gets shots away. He could be the outstanding player today. 
Oh, great attacking play. Putting his body on the line. Oh, he's given it away inexplicably. Oh, he wasn't ruthless enough in front of goal. Keeper has it now. Well, that's a foul, and it sets up a free kick in a dangerous position. taken but saved easily by the keeper Jorginho on the ball Azpilicueta might be onto something with that ball Azpilicueta Mount Kovacic wonderful block Kovacic well, defenders having to cover up. Rafael Varane. Bruno Fernandes. Rashford. Rashford. Bruno Fernandes. Oh, a stellar piece of defending. Ericsson. Can they forge ahead? Oh, marvellous defending to deny him. And the free kick awarded to Manchester United. And the referee might well have been tempted to book him for that. Resisted the temptation. quite the blast but nowhere close to the goal Jorginho Kai Havertz well, they're on the scent of something positive. Kovacic. Well, let's see about the cross. Well, the attack carried an initial threat, but fizzled out. Can he get them in front? Not to be in terms of the finish. mistake well they really were dicing with a lot of danger well he's made up for his mistake but he got lucky there that's for sure struggling to keep the ball Bruno Fernandes Rashford just missing narrowly on the volley. Well, it's a fantastic effort. Difficult technique, but he caught it so well. He's unfortunate. Mateo Kovacic. This is Thiago Silva. Trevo Shalaba. Kepa, Koulibaly, Chilwell, excellent vision, well, nothing comes of the attack when all is said and done, chance to run at them, and space to cross it, 
Well, goal kick, just as it was looking promising. Well, what about that opportunity a few minutes ago? We can see it again now. Thiago Silva. On to Jorginho. Might be able to set up the chance. Oh, yes! Goal for Chelsea! It's the opening statement in the final. And it could be massively important for them. Well, here it is again. He goes past his marker so easily with just a drop of the shoulder. But there's still plenty to do from here. He hits it so well, though. Lots of pace, lots of power, and the keeper just can't react in time. It's a great strike. So on they go again, and that really should shake up United. Can they find a response now? Casemiro. Bruno Fernandes has it. Read it well. And the conditions look pretty good for the counter-attack. We're getting right on top of their opponents and winning it back. And so it is, the first half story has been written. to the second half then in this battle for Champions League glory well far from the ideal pass Bruno Fernandes now with Rashford United might be able to cash in oh what an opportunity Oh, marvellous goalkeeping. Well, it's a top-class save from a top-class goalkeeper. That's absolutely brilliant. <laughs> Going short. Fernandes. This is Varane. Rashford. Element of risk there, but he's won the ball. Now, who can he play it to? And saved by the keeper. Kick taken by Christian Eriksen. Well, no end product. No high quality defending. Breaking at pace. Havertz. Now with Sterling. Well, it was a superb counter-attack. Not such high marks for the finish. Well, the build-up to the shot was great. Good defending, quick transition and excellent movement. It just needed a much better finish.
Jadon Sancho. Now potential danger. Rashford is through. And tremendous goalkeeping. Well, he just made it so difficult for the striker. His presence alone just caused him a problem. And now the delivery. Not really the ideal clearance. Casemiro. And he had clearly drifted into an offside position. Well, you can see from his reaction, he knew that wouldn't count. Chilwell. Sterling. Koulibaly. Here's Kovacic. And Kovacic seeing his pass intercepted. Well, he has the measure of his opponent. Rashford. Eriksson. Oh, the equaliser. Just what they needed. And the dream remains very much alive. Well, we can take another look now. It's great interplay between the two of them to start the move off. And there's certainly no doubt about the finish. He really hits it with power and accuracy. Nothing the keeper can do about that. So back underway following the equaliser. Jorginho Jorginho given away by Chelsea Mount here's Havertz Kovacic and a shame that he couldn't find the target from there in front he's foiled them on his own well the possession tells you everything nothing really to split between the two sides it's been an enthralling encounter up to now with both teams playing some really good expansive football you just wonder if the coach will be looking at that and how they can tighten up at the back as it's been chance after chance right now and perhaps another chance in the making for them here And blocked for now. Still level here, but the pressure escalating. That's Pili Quetta. Well, they couldn't keep possession. Chelsea have given us away and he's in oh a goal to give them the lead and look at the celebrations well you have to ask where's the defending the keeper is completely exposed but he still had to finish it and he did it really well it's a good goal A big moment in the dying embers. Will it prove decisive here? And the keeper more than equal to the task. So a personnel change then. And there's the delivery. Well, it has come to nothing. They'll repeat the threat. Corner again. <laughs> Try.
trying to deliver it accurately. Still not clear. Danger averted for now. Very quick thinking there. Ten minutes to go. Bruno Fernandes. Rashford, fine pass. Can he keep his composure? Oh, a great chance it was. Goalkeeper has it. Well, in the dying embers of the game here, and Chelsea still narrowly behind. Time running out, Stuart. Well, it's been a tight match, but they haven't done quite enough going forward, in my view. It's all been a bit too predictable. A lot of passing, but not enough penetration. They have to get crosses into the box in these final few minutes if they want to get anything out of this. Well, they are committed to making the substitution here. And over it comes. Well, it still could be dangerous. Koulibaly. He read the situation defensively and did his job. Bruno Fernandes. Breaking at pace. Firing it in. Superb block. Well, a corner it is. And they know they've got to be opportunistic at this stage of the game. Playing it in. The clearance wasn't decisive. Oh, he's missed, but by a minuscule margin. Well, he couldn't have made better contact than that. His technique is brilliant. He's so unlucky there. And a blunder by the keeper. here well here we can see it again and it doesn't get any better does it that's just sloppy from the goalkeeper that's a terrible goal to give away Again here, this has been quite the roller coaster ride. Manchester United venture forward. Do they have a winning goal in the future? Really a very poor ball. Marcus Rashford. Fernand. Can he put them in front? No is the answer to the question. And that could be so important at this stage. Well, will they get another chance? That would surely have won the game for them. Well, that's it for the 90 minutes. But this is not over. And two 15-minute periods of extra time to come. Understandable that fatigue might set in. A strength sapping night for all concerned as the first period of extra time begins. Advantage Manchester United. Well, beating his opponent. Fred! Oh, a good diving save.
And now the delivery. Jaden Sancho. Determined defending. Beautifully weighted ball. And he's kept it out. Fully stretched. Somehow reaching it. And he's fired over the corner. Well, he read the delivery superbly, but couldn't quite keep the header down. <laughs> Rashford. Read it well. Can they forge ahead? And that's an excellent piece of defending to thwart him. Might be a chance here. It's one of the saves of the season from De Gea. Who can they pick out? Oh, blocked it! And a touch off the defender, last of all, so a corner. What a vital intervention! Fred. Diogo Dallo. Rashford. He's holding the ball up here effectively, waiting for support to arrive. Well, mopping up defensively. Sancho. Well, a really single minded piece of defending to make sure nothing untoward happened. McTominay. On to Rashford. Well, he had the measure of it, the goalkeeper. And United will switch things around personnel-wise. And over comes the corner. It could be up for grabs. United looking to forge ahead. Let's see if the corner helps them. They will now make use of the substitutes bench. Trying to pick out a teammate. Not all that convincing defensively. Reading it well. Fred. Oh, surely. Well, what a stop that was. Half time in extra time, and still they are level. And so, 15 more minutes. We're into the second period of extra time here. Pili Quetta. Obama Young waiting. And it's a double for him in this game. No way for the opposition to contain him. And no wonder he's off celebrating.
Well, here's the replay, and it all starts with the delivery into the box, just begging someone to get on the end of it. And then what a great finish as well. Good connection with the ball, leaving the keeper with little chance. It's a great goal. Dramatic moment near the end, and that might well be the decider. Fred, what a bad pass it was. Marcus Rashford, showing a lot of guile there. Rashford, fine pass. And a goal here, just what Manchester United required. They Well, here it is again. He goes past his marker so easily with just a drop of the shoulder. And there's certainly no doubt about the finish. He really hits it with power and accuracy. Nothing the keeper can do about that. Well, another equaliser. What a topsy-turvy game this has been. Rather than a free kick, it's advantage Chelsea. Loftus-Cheek. And a timely intervention. Well, five minutes remaining in this the second period of extra time. Throw in to Manchester United. Fred. Oh, breezing past him. He'll be delighted to have won the ball, having made that difficult challenge. Well, the counter chance looks very real. Still level, but Chelsea on the attack, near the end. Pini Quetta, the delivery, and what a moment for Chelsea, a late goal that could be so significant in this final. Well, here it is again, and what a perfect cross into the box this is, just inviting someone to attack it, but the finish is far too easy, he doesn't even have to jump, how has he afforded that much space, it's a tidy header, but really poor defending. emotions out there joy and relief on one side despair and heartache on the other but we've got the right winners here they fully deserved it on the night for these players well it's the night of their lives and they're determined to enjoy every millisecond well they have to make the most of this don't they it's a great feat what an achievement from them well, they don't need to be reminded about what comes next. It's the presentation of the coveted Champions League trophy. Well, there's some tired players out there, but what you can be sure of, they'll find some energy when they get their hands on the trophy. They'll be going mad in the next few moments. The Champions League winners, Chelsea. Well, this is what they wanted. What a moment for these players. They've worked so hard to win this trophy. They've been fantastic. And you can feel the emotion.
It's natural to reflect on this final, but so much hard work has gone into the entire campaign. Memories, memories. What would a celebration be without the chance to enjoy it with your own supporters? Well, these fans have certainly played their part, haven't they? They'll savour these moments. They've travelled far and wide to follow their team. They're loving every minute of this, and why not? They deserve it. A performance of fire as well as ice. They held their nerve when that was necessary. And these celebrations will run long into the night. Well, these are the moments they have to make the most of. It doesn't happen very often, does it? These will be photos to cherish for years to come. Brilliant stuff. And you are looking at the best club side in Europe.